Oh, you did. Okay. This is the Yamato DP63 vacuum oven. Oven chamber is on the top half of the unit. Has a max temperature of 200 degrees C. All the controls are on the front panel here. You can hook up a purge gas, which would be this, which I have closed right now. Your vacuum pump, which is in the back, I'll show you that, um, is connected here. The pump would be on normally. Open it up to create the vacuum, close it to close the vacuum. I have it closed right now. I'm in the process of final testing the vacuum uh, ability. That's why this tape is here, just so I know where it was and it's holding. Your controller for the temperature is here. It's a programmable controller, able to store programs. It's also, uh, you can set it as a fixed rate, which is what I've got it at right now. And as you can see, I've got it set at the max 200. It's reading 200. I did a ramp rate profile, and it matched what's in the in the manual. You can access the different areas. Uh, there's menu mode and display. Uh, all of that is in the manual, but I just show you that you can go there and you can change your temperature to whatever you want it to be. When you've made your changes, hit enter, and it accepts those changes. <coughs> It also gives you a visual display. As it's ramping up, these LEDs would be flashing. Now that it's reached temperature, it shows you that, that it's there. It's capable, as I said, of ramping or in the program, or as a fixed rate controller. Power for the controller is here. It's not power to the entire unit, it's just power to the controller. And turning on the heat would be have to be accessed, of course, through the controller. On the right hand side here is your circuit breaker behind this uh, cutout. So the main circuit breaker for the unit is located right here. Okay, here's your purge input gas that you would hook up here. And your vacuum line is here. I have the vacuum pump currently outside of the unit. It'll be shipped on the in, on the inside here, and you can normally run it from in there if you'd like to. The vacuum pump operates on 115. The unit itself is 220 volts, 14 and a half amps when when heating at full power.